Across India, from the largest cities to the smallest hamlet, you can see construction. People building their houses, large residential development and infrastructure can be found all over the country. Better housing and infrastructure require construction materials, which in turn require resources. Traditionally, the main construction material in India has been brick. Yet brick manufacturing has led to the excessive use of topsoil, and brick kilns are a major source of air pollution. Brick manufacturing is the second biggest source of NOx and SOx, and the estimated 150 billion bricks made from 500 million tons of fertile topsoil in 100,000 small-scale kilns burn vast amounts of wood, leading to large-scale deforestation. Over the past decades, India has switched to a far more sustainable choice of building material, concrete. Concrete is made of cement and aggregates mixed with water. India now manufactures large amounts of cement and is even set to overtake China as the biggest global producer. The main raw material for cement production is limestone. However, at current production levels, limestone reserves in India are expected to last only 45 years. India already uses a lot of alternative raw materials, such as fly ash, a waste material from power plants. But these alternative materials are not always available in sufficient quantities or in the right place. LC3 is a perfect fit and can help extend India's limestone reserves. The major innovation in LC3 is to combine the use of an abundantly available low-grade kaolinite clay with a further 15% of ground limestone, which was often unsuitable for cement production, with no reduction in mechanical performance. LC3 recovers low-grade kaolinite that, up until now, was discarded in China clay quarries. Not only is it resource efficient, it can also reduce CO2 emissions of cement production by up to 30%. LC3 offers similar, or in some cases even better, performance compared to traditional Portland cement and can be easily integrated in the production process of existing cement plants. It's currently undergoing pre-industrial trials in several countries, including India, and can help double the lifespan of Indian limestone reserves. Sustainability bagged.